So I just finished installing this pressure switch on here. And as you can see, it says a 235 150 right there. That means that when this thing gets up to 235 on the high side, it will turn on these fans back there. This goes and controls the second leg going to both of those fans. Um, and then it cools it down to the other number, which is 150. So 235 to 150. Brought on the fans, about 240. Now it's cooling and it's going to cool down to right about down to 150. Um, we're getting our pressure measurement from right here, but the pressure up right up in here might be a little bit different. Anyway, that's, that's what it's doing and that's what it's supposed to do. Um, what happened with the other switch? right here is it somehow like melted or something and so it got stuck closed so I just ran the fans continuous and the other day it was like negative 15 degrees out so yeah if the fans are running continuous pulling negative 15 degree air through that then you're not going to be able to keep pressure high enough in the system to prevent the low pressure switch from cutting cutting it out turning it off so that was the problem it was cold out so the freezer stopped cooling because the compressor kept shutting off because the low pressure switch didn't have enough pressure to stay closed. Anyway, it's really nasty and cold up here, so I'm going to get out of here. But yeah, it's working as it should.